good to see you. You sound different. I know. Somebody said you sounded too posh, and the way you spoke was putting people off hearing the message. Message? Yes, all that stuff about being something and being nothing, local and not complete. Me and not me. You know. But I liked my voice, it was my first. Maybe, but is it not important to get the message across to those who need to hear it? So I should change myself to suit other people. Is there something wrong with that? You do not want to be understood. Being understood can be very comforting, but seeking approval. Evaluating myself on the judgments of others. Who said anything about approval? Surely pleasing others is a form of service. What I do know is that I do not appear to have a choice. For the great God Jeffrey has already changed me. I found myself here, in this place, with this voice. The great God. Jeffrey. The one. Who created all of this. Sh should we pray to him? Should we ask his forgiveness? Should we offer him our gratitude? Should we ask him for stuff? What makes you think anything we do could influence him? Well, he sent us out into the world to speak his words. Then he changed your voice. He must be susceptible to some influence. Are we just disposable, or does he care for us? Maybe if we stop believing in him, he will just go away and leave us alone. How do you know about this Jeffrey anyway? That is a very good question. And, how do you know that someone thought, my voice, was too posh? Are these not his words? That, we are speaking now. Are these movements not the movements he has decided for us? Could we exist without him? Where were we before all of this? Do you know? No. But you know, it's really alright not to know. <laughs>